And said Abraham to his slave oldest in his house, the one who ruled in all that was to him, put please your hand under my thigh and I will make you swear by Jehovah. God of the heavens and God of the earth, that not you shall take a wife for my son from the girls of the Canaanite, whom I dwell among, but to my country and to my kindred you shall go and take a wife for my son. For Isaac, and said to him the slave, Perhaps not will be willing the woman to follow me to the land this. Truly shall I bring back your son into the land which you came out from. And said to him, Abraham, Take heed for yourself, lest you take back my son there. Jehovah, the God of the heavens, who took me from the house of my father and from the land of my birth, and who spoke to me and who swore to me saying to your seed I will give this land land this he shall send his angel before you and you shall take a wife for my son from there and if not, will be willing the woman to go after you. Then you shall be clear from my oath this. Only my son not do take back there. And put the slave his hand under the thigh of Abraham, his master, and swore to him concerning thing this, and took the servant ten camels of the camels of his master, and left in all the goods of his master were in his hand and he arose and went to Mesopotamia to the city of Nahor and he knelt the camels outside the city by a well of water at the time of the evening the time that they go out to draw. And he said, Jehovah God of my master Abraham, cause her to meet. Please before me this day and show cause to meet Please before me this day and show to kindness my master Abraham. Lo, I am standing by the well of water, and the daughters of men of the city are coming out to draw water. And let the girl whom I shall speak to let down, please, your pitcher. Please let down your pitcher that I may drink. 
and she will say drink and also your camels I will water her you have designed for your servant let it be her you have designed for your servant for Isaac for Isaac and by this I shall know in this by I shall know that you have done kindness to my master and it happened before he had finished speaking Behold, Rebekah came out, who was born to Bethuel, the son of Milcah, the wife of Nahor, the brother of Abraham. Her pitcher on her shoulder, and the girl was good of form very a virgin a man not knowing her and she went down to the well and filled her pitcher and came up and ran the slave to meet her and said let me sip please a little water from your pitcher and she said drink my lord and she hurried and let down her pitcher her hand on her hand and gave him drink and she finished giving him drink and she said also for your camels I will draw until they have finished drinking And she hurried and emptied her pitcher into the trough. And she ran again to the well to draw and drew for all his camels. And the man watching her kept silent in order to know if it had prospered Jehovah his way or not. And it happened when had finished the camel's drinking that took the man a ring golden, a half shekel its weighing, and two bracelets for her hands, ten of gold their weighing. And he said, Whose daughter are you? Please tell me, tell please me. Is there in house your father's room for us to stay? And she said to him, The daughter of Bethuel, I, the son of Milcah, whom she bore to Nahor, and she said, To him both straw and fodder are plentiful with us also a room to pass the night and bowed the man and worshipped Jehovah. And he said, Blessed be Jehovah. God of my master Abraham, who not has forsaken his kindness and his truth with my master.
I in the way led me Jehovah to house brothers, my masters, and ran the girl and told house her mother's things these and Rebecca had a brother his name being La Ben Laban and ran Laban to meet the man out to the fountain and it was when he saw the ring and the bracelets on the hands of his sister and when he heard the words of Rebecca his sister saying thus spoke to me the man then he came to the man and beheld him standing by the camels at the fountain and he said come in blessed of Jehovah why are you standing outside?